this is Tim Roberts, Application Engineer with Go Engineer. This quick tip video, I'm going to demonstrate some of the new sheet metal functionality for SolidWorks 2016 regarding edge flanges. And we'll do this on a simple part. And we'll choose millimeters as our template. It'll just be a simple U-shaped uh, sheet metal base flange. I'll make sure that my sheet metal tab on the command manager is turned on. We simply check or uncheck any of the tabs that we want to appear on the command manager here. So we'll go to base flange. This will be our sketch. We'll uh, start our sheet metal part. And this is where we get into new functionality for 2016. I want to do an edge flange to this lower edge here. So I'll select the edge, drag it out to certain size and we'll go to edit flange profile now when we do this you, you may or may not realize that you're in a sketch you're actually editing uh, the sketch for the edge flange itself and this part is um, perhaps not new let me go normal to sketch for clarity and we can drag this to resize our flange here uh, we might even decide that we wanted to modify the flange profile in such a way that uh, it's not just a square. Let's trim that out. Okay, and, and none of this is new, new functionality. <clears throat> That's been there for some time. But for 2016, now we can go in and edit uh, our feature. Let's edit the uh, edge flange sketch. We'll choose edit, edit flange profile again. And this time we can extend past uh, our point of origin. And this is something new. Uh, we could not do this before. Let's uh, carry this out to a drawing. Uh, you may or may not know that when you make a drawing, we'll say file make drawing from part, we will drop in our flat pattern view and this will automatically create a derived configuration in our sheet metal part. For instance, we'll choose flat pattern. Okay. Now as I go back to my sheet metal part, we'll see that we now have uh, a derived flat pattern. Okay. If I activate this, this becomes the flat. Thanks for watching this quick tip video. My name is Tim Roberts. Mm -hmm.